And good morning to you. This is the KSL Fastcast for Tuesday, September 16th. I'm Sheriff Park. Here are the top local headlines this morning. A suspect took police on a wild chase overnight through four cities. It all started when West Valley police got a call of a suspicious vehicle in a parking lot. Well, when they arrived, the man was sleeping in the front of the car. But when he woke up, he drove off, leading officers on an hour-long chase, speeds up to 90 miles per hour. Police finally spiked his tires near Taylorsville, but... Then he tried to run. Eventually, he was caught in someone's backyard. The man now faces a DUI fleeing and possession of drug charges. And one person was killed in an early morning mine accident in Carbon County. It happened at the West Ridge Mine run by the Utah American Energy Inc uh, Incorporated. Uh, the company has identified the victim as 46-year-old Alejandro Ramirez from Price. Ramirez has been working at the mine for six years, according to the company. Right now, the cause of the accident is under investigation. And today, protesters are planning to gather outside the Saratoga Springs Police Department to protest the police shooting and killing of Darian Hunt. Now, the investigation into the shooting has ignited controversy as differing reports come from witnesses. The Hunt family's attorney says that a private autopsy showed Hunt was shot in the back multiple times, and they believe as he was running away. Police say the officers opened fire when Hunt lunged at them with what they called a samurai sword. The case has now been turned over to the Utah County attorney. Now let's check on our FastCast forecast for today. Salt Lake with a high of 91, Ogden 87, Provo 90, and St. George climbing back up to 98. And that's the KSL FastCast for this Tuesday. Have a great morning. We'll see you.